Okay, everyone, Meowcity here. Today we're playing Darkest Dungeon again, and we're going to look into upgrading the Hamlet as much as we can. Excuse me. Uh, we're going to look into upgrading the Hamlet as much as we can, as well as diving into the Cove and maybe the Weald. But I really want to see what this thing from the stars is. So maybe we'll encounter it, maybe we won't. This is our only party that is in full, not kind of recovering in some way this week. So that's what we're taking. So let's get to it. If I can remember how to play. <laughs> All right, so since this is a short mission, we're going to take the bare essentials here. But we're also going to take... A l oh, I don't need that exactly. Um, so we should be good with that. Let's go. The fiends must be driven back. All right. What better place to begin than the seat of our noble line? Complete 100% of room battles. So we might as well check down here, because otherwise we have to come back a lot. Uh, let's use some medicinal herbs here. Some extra stuff. Use them. Seems like a bit of a waste, but use them here too. And we got ourselves a room battle. Alright, we don't need to de stress, and neither of them can bleed, so let's go for more damage. Uh, we will go for Blight on him, the Herbalist. Right, I don't feel like we need to necessarily heal. So let's just do damage. Let's see if we can... Nope, we're gonna miss like usual. Gonna continue damaging. Our bliss down. Going to try to take out the cord here. Light might do that next round, which means I can lay into these guys. Might be worth healing a little bit now. Cordier down, might as well heal. Uh, can't captivate him, so we're gonna rabble or um, stab the rabble, de stress because we can't hurt him otherwise. And chop him. Not too bad of a battle. And what's this? Is it merely a trick of the light? It's a highwayman only trinket, so we might put that on. Uh, 70, 80, and 60, so we'll use that. And then might as well fix them while we can. Alright, back the other way. I feel like this is a bad idea. Oh, journal entry. That might be interesting later. Right, let's see how many we can take out. Can artillery them and miss. Harvest might be good. This two, so if I were to do this. There we go. No damage. Gonna leave that alone, because I don't have the herbs for it. 
I just realized I'm not in the cove. Like I thought I was. I hit the wrong button, I'm in the ruins. Wow, I'm I'm a moron. Well, I'll rectify that later. Cause I, I literally can't go back and do something about it. I swear I clicked on it though. Wouldn't be the first time I did something stupid like that. Or didn't click in the right, exact right spot or something. <laughs> oh boy. Alright, uh, let's take out the courtier. Let's heal the jester. Oof. Come on, Perry, you can live. Slice off the madman, take him out. We're doing fine still. Take out the soldier. Nope, gonna miss. Captivate the herbalist. Uh oh. Alright, take out the soldier. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. Heal Perry. Good heal. Slice off the arbalist and take we're good. As the enemy crumbles. Now do I have bandages? I do not have bandages. A but a victory nonetheless. We're gonna use some torches. Alright, we're good with this. Wait, I hit that. I'll go back and get the curio after, but... I hit that multiple times and it wasn't activating. Alright, um... Let's go back to... Captivate Acolyte. I mean... Some damage is better than no damage, and it moves me kinda where I want it to be. We gotta do some stress control and such, though. This is not going very well. Perry. We can. Ooh. That flight will get him soon. Two of them are gonna die to blight. That's kinda nice. Heal a shield bearer, breaker. Don't know why I keep making that mistake. Uh, de stress.
and we poke him. Slowly, gently. This is how a life is taken. Heal. And we're good. Alright, I'm gonna go get this Kirio right here, just because I know I clicked on it before. Glittering gold, trinkets and baubles. Paid for. There we go. Let's go get the last few room battles, I guess. Leave that alone, use Even a shovel. Gold stone seems bent on preventing passage. Seeing blow to body and brain. Good hit there. <coughs> uh, we need to de stress a few people here. The blood quickens. Heal. He has four, so if we hew, he'll probably die. Alright, Perry needs to be de-stressed. We can captivate the Doomsayer. Probably die on his next turn now. You can Eldritch pull him. Now everyone's in range for everything. Uh oh. Well, we can save the others. Captivate them. Hugh. I mean, I'm trying with that stress relief. It's not working too well. And the leopard just cannot hit. There we go. Just end that fight before it gets much worse. Seize this momentum. Push on to the task's end. Alright. Let's make some room. Uh we don't have room for all this. Oh boy. Uh I kinda want this. And I feel like we don't need the keys. I'm, that's gonna bite me in the butt though, so... 375, 250... Yeah, let's get rid of the citrines. Probably could've gotten rid of the holy water, to be honest. Alright. 
So we'll go here and that'll be it. And he's okay. I couldn't still switch him. All right, this is doable. We're gonna harvest to get them bleeding. We're going to artillery to just end this. We're going to captivate the big guy. That did stress them out. Yeah, we really want to get rid of him. Chop him. He'll take five damage on his next turn. And now the true test. Hold fast. Or expire. All right, we need to heal Perry. He won't let us. So we'll do that and hope he doesn't die. Take him out, he'll die on his next turn. There goes Perry. I got a hint to the leper, he hasn't uh, gone insane or anything. So take that, I'll take that, and I don't think I can take the rest of this. So that'll be that. Let's get them some treatment, because they kind of need it. Not sure it's entirely worth it, but... Alright, obsessed with the paranormal, on guard. Calm. Doesn't matter that he got Torn Rotator, but Skilled Gambler and Perry died. Women and men, soldiers and outlaws, fools and corpses. All will find their way to us now that the road is clear. Huh. A long, a day long awaited. Word of our predicament has spread, and a crop of aspiring corpses is set from the stagecoach. That is dark. Six more recruits than usual. Are they any good? Flagellant? Okay, we can replace the jester we lost. But otherwise, it's kind of eh. Technically, we could almost replace this group. Might honestly be cheaper than, um... Getting treatment for them. Because I'm not really liking that leper. Maybe they're good later, but... Um, okay, so I think what the plan is going to be, as bad as this is, we're going to dismiss Gale, so we can get another occultist. We're going to dismiss Bully. Then, okay, which one of these guys is better? Punish, 
can use in the first two, first two, anyone, and clear mark, transfer bleed, transfer blight, self, mark target, minus 20% stress, plus six. Okay. And he can use that in the first two. Okay, I feel like this one's going to be more worthwhile to have. And then, was there two occultists or just the one? So we'll grab him. To fight the abyss, one must know it. We're going to have to replace one skill on him when we get there, and then grab him. And then there's more bleeding in that group. At the end. And then we'll get... Oh, that's the wrong place. Him the treatment he needs. Him the treatment he kind of needs. And... Russell can kind of... He's not going to get it. Alright. And I really want to know what this... Oh, that's really bad, though. I can go find out what the Sonorous Prophet is. And what the thing from the stars is. If I sit and, um... That's a really good abomination item. Is there anything else out there that's decent? Yeah, there's nothing else out there I'm too keen on getting, so this is probably suicidal. But we're gonna try it out. I'm gonna see if they need any upgrades first. I can get this, meaning a sharper sword, a stronger shield, anything to prolong a soldier's life. Alright, so I probably need the rest for provisions. This is a medium, so we're definitely going to need provisions. And I forgot to check this. Nothing he can have, nothing, nothing, and nothing. These are all... Every thing I have is for very specific people. Okay. Well then. Let's do this. Oh god, this seems like a bad idea. I'm resigned to losing them. They're, they're gonna die. were well underway when a particularly ragged indigent arrived in the hamlet. This filthy, toothless miscreant boasted an uncanny knowledge of my ambitions and prognosticated publicly that, left unchecked, I would soon unleash doom upon the world. Okay. The echoes of his mindless tittering reverberate maddeningly. Six, seven, eight. Seven. Yeah, so the boss is probably going to be right here. Just so we know where to go. Uh, 
I can already tell the title of this episode. Mistakes were made. Alright, how bad is this one? Blasting effects. Demon mania? Believes is possessed by demons. <laughs> this is why you don't read books. Alright. So we're going to do what we can to cut them down. It's a lot of damage. Next turn, he's going to die to his own wounds. So I can safely heal him back up. success oh come on all right let's start by trying to take out the back row Night. This is all livable. Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. Gotta say, I really like the shield breakers. Another one falls. All right, we'll take him out, and then wounds. The blight will kill him, so we'll heal up. Use that to get an artificial torch. Heal again. I mean, I probably deserved that one. <sighs> More books. You'd think I learned my lesson. Try to fry them. And it looks like that worked rather well. And the front row is gone. I can get him. Then he's gonna die to his own wounds. Get everyone back in position. Slow and insidious killer. Come on, food. Wealth beyond measure. Awarded to the brave and the foolhardy alike. No, that wasn't a sparkle of coins. Stop picking up stuff you're not supposed to. Oh, this could be bad. Oh, 
I'm not gonna have food to, get to camp with. Packs laden with loot are often low on supplies. They're hungry people. I'm not sure how they've eaten this much. All right, take out the arbalist. Oof. Blast him. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. Crit for 30, wow. Well, I can reposition. Surges as the enemy crumbles. Alter of light. Oh, geez, they're here. This is bad. I could get vampires. And I'm not in the court. Alright, uh, light. It's not good on them. Destroyed. Okay. That going. Uh, try to stun. Oh, they have really high stun resistance. He doesn't know. The mosquito. Alright, that's him down. Guess I'll have to gamble on this. I was hoping that'd get the sick of hand, but I guess not. Right, we can still get him. Hi, that's not bad. I can give that to her. Resistance. Use the skeleton key. Finding the stuff is only the first test. Now it must be carried home. All right. I mean, I want to camp, but I only have three food. So, like, if I did, there's a good chance I wouldn't uh, be able to do anything. Oh jeez, really? And now the true test. Hold fast or expire. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. I need her alive. <laughs> okay, and it did save that death. I wasn't sure it was going to do that, but it looks like it still did. Give them no quarter. So yeah, I'm still in a bad spot here, as you can see. But we'll still try to take on the boss. Annihilated. Executed with impunity. 
That's our blight charm back. So too will resistance. Guess we'll give it to Reynold. Oh boy, this is not gonna go well. The way is lit. The path is clear. We require only the strength to follow it. All right, here goes nothing. The madman hides there. Okay, we can't blight or bleed them. I think blight would maybe do something, but... Repost, just so I can do damage back. Start getting through these. Oh boy. I'll go back. I want to go back, not forward. I read wrong. Rampart forward. Oof. Right. Um, kind of want to keep her in place, so how much health does I have? Six. All right, we are going to start buffing the dodge. And we need to crud. Well, at least he dodged it while he was stunned. <laughs> Stab him again. Take out a pew. Oh boy. Okay, um what's he has no blight or bleed resistance, so I could do this and start really hurting him. And then if I can get through another pew I can start laying on the hurt. Alright, we're gonna retribution him. That way I start hitting him every time he does something again. Ugh. -huh. And now the true test. Hold fast or expire. Okay. Zealous accusation, get rid of the pew. Going to captivate him, get that blight on. Yeah. Oh, they put. I didn't see that. But that's at least until camp. Alright, so. That's a high stun resistance. Oh 
Okay. We've got this. Eighteen more health. We're down our shield bearer. Breaker. Two deaths. Alright, can we get him? We got him. Two thousand five hundred gold per, for each pew. Move stone and then slippery boots. Well, I mean, it could be worse. And then we got some uh, gold, some bus, some crests, and some, a restraining padlock, which is really good for an abomination. We did not see the thing from the stars, thankfully. Luet got the yips, which we're gonna have to remove. And Reynold got the rune scrounger. And le level 3, so. We dug for months, years, an eternity. And we were rewarded with madness. An excommunicated madman has responded to the growing infestation in kind, fueled by conviction he is merciless and plies his trade with extreme prejudice the fanatic will stock parties with infected heroes so business beware i guess sorry about that cat's allergies were worse than mine and had to give her some eye drops wait is that the fanatic right there that's kind of cool um all right so reynolds level three so it might be difficult to send him on some stuff later on. We have a new shield bit breaker we can put in his group for now. But otherwise, anything might be hard. Don't have the deeds to open up anything else there. And he definitely needs to de-stress. Alright, what else did we need to do for the Hamlet? I know there is stuff I wanted to do here. This would actually be nice. Some food is granted for free each week. Yeah, I think that's going to be really beneficial for us in the long run, because then we're paying less gold for food, and we have more gold going forward. Plus more health when eating. So that, that'll be good for us. Um, otherwise, let me take a look here. Accuracy, range, skills, minus one speed. That could actually be really good. So I think next time... I know I said this time we would go into the cove. But next time we are definitely going into the cove because I want this. And I think it'll go really good on our highwaymen for sure in that group, because everyone there uses ranged skills, so that's something we kind of need. So that, that'll that be the plan for next time. 
Um, I don't really have a good grasp on how long this episode has been running because of the multiple cuts and stops I had to do, especially with the power cut. Um, so I think I'm going to end this episode probably a bit early, but we got another bigger boss down and some mistakes were made. So I have to take a look at things and go, okay, what do we have to do where to kind of make up for the losses? And then next time we will be going into the cove. Um, so yeah, I'm not as much as it would be nice to get the extra stuff from going on uh, the in veteran mission there. I don't really like the haste chalice, so we'll, we'll go to here. So that's the plan. Look forward to that. I hope everyone's having fun. If you have any comments, um, suggestions, or anything like that, please feel free to post down in the comments. I'm always open to suggestions like that. Otherwise, as always, I wish you all well. I'll see you next time, and have a good one.